The doe's secret coat of honor is as old as the goats themselves and is ultimately the species' best kept secret. No doe shall ever kid before its time. Its time being determined by the following factors. Number one, no kid shall be born until total chaos has been reached by all involved. Your owner's house must be a wreck, their family hungry and desperate for clean clothes, and their social life non-existent. Number two, midwives must reach the babbling fool status before you kid out. Bloodshot eyes, tangled hair, and the inability to form a sentence mean the time is getting close. Number three, for every bell, beeper, camera, or whistle they attach to you, kidding must be delayed at least one day for each item. If they use an audio monitor, one good yell per hour will keep things interesting. Number four, if you hear the words, she's nowhere near ready, she'll be fine while we're away for the weekend. Wait until they load the car, then begin pushing. Number five, owner stress must be at an all time high. If you are in the care of someone else, 10 to 15 phone calls a day is a sign you're getting close. Hi, um, I'm not sure about the doe, but she's out there and she, I think she might be in labor, but I don't know. All right, well, I'll keep calling you with updates. <sighs> so I need to have the beta dime ready, right? Does, does chewing her cud and then stopping every few minutes mean that she's getting close? I mean, she seems to be, she'll like go and then she'll chew it. Does that mean she's getting really close? Oh, okay. Number six, when you hear the words, I can't take it anymore, wait at least three more days. Number seven, you must keep this waiting game interesting. False alarms are mandatory. Little teasers such as looking at your stomach, pushing your food around in the bucket, and then walking away from it and nesting are always good for a rise. Be creative and find new things to do to keep the uh, adrenaline pumping in those who wait. Number eight, the honor of all goats is now in your hands. Use this time to avenge all your barn mates. Think about your friend who had to wear that silly costume in front of those people. Hang on to that baby for another day. Oh, they made him do tricks too? Three more days seems fair. Late feedings, the dreaded diet, bad haircuts, those awful wormings can also be avenged at this time. Number nine. If you have fulfilled all of the above and are still not sure when to have the kids, listen to the weather forecast on the radio that has been so generously provided by those who wait. Severe storm warning is what you're looking for. A blizzard warning remains in effect until midnight Thursday. Falling temperatures combined with strong winds may result in wind chill values of 15 to 25 below zero Wednesday night. This is an extremely dangerous storm. Combined with the severe cold, this storm may result in loss of life if proper precautions are not taken. In the heart of the storm, jump into action. Number 10. The power could go out and you could have the last laugh. You have a good chance of those who wait missing the whole thing while searching for a flashlight that works. Number 11. Make the most of your interrupted nights. Beg for food each time someone comes into the barn to check on you. Your barn mates will love you as the extra goodies fall their way too. Remember, this code of honor was designed to remind man of how truly special goats are. Do your best to reward those who wait with a beautiful doling to carry on the Doe's code of honor for the next generation of those who wait.